Go to the video in question. Click Control U, as in Utopia. It'll bring up another window, hopefully. Now hit Control F. In the search bar, type in the word category and start hitting the down arrow. It's always 99% going to be the second one. It's never going to be the S-Box inappropriate category. Let's go to the second one. In this case, it is under entertainment for this video. Let's use another example. Control U. Control F. This time he has it under the gaming category. And a third and final example. Control U. Control F. The second one, this one, he's got it under people and blogs. So I wanted to show you uh, from the same YouTuber three different categories that they could be in. This used to be shown under the show more. For some reason, they removed it. I have an add-on called VidIQ, which is amazing. I use the free version. That's how you can see how many total views a channel has, what are the average per day, where they're from, what's their rank, how many subscribers, views in the last 30 days, what video tags did they use. But it won't show you the category in which the video was put in. And you may want to know this just because you're a nosy little bastard or because you're uploading similar content and you're not quite sure what category it should go into because it's not always blatantly obvious. So there you have it. Short, sweet, to the point. And like some other YouTubers that just by now would be starting to get into showing you how to do this. So if you liked the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It does greatly help support the channel with the algorithm and making me a little bit more relevant. If you didn't like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. I'll bend it in half, twist it, break it off in your ass. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, I mean, naturally, that would be wonderful now, wouldn't it? But if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care. Maybe I'll see some of you in the next video. Bye for now.